the day. What's going on, fellas? We're back to the Ventura. I've run this thing for about 18 hours or so, and I wanted to take a look inside of it to see if I need to run that burner at higher rates, and it looks like I do. I'm seeing actual black tar. So 600 watts is not gonna cut it. We're gonna have to run hotter than that. We wanna see just ash in here. And I kind of could tell this was going to happen by the temperature readings I was getting. So at this rate, I'd probably have to clean it like every 20 or 30 fires or something. And I don't want to have to do that. So I'm just going to start running that burner a little bit hotter. Running the blower a little bit hotter, I mean. Probably running it around 7 to 800 watts, which kind of sucks. But uh, that's what Venturas do. So... While we got this thing out, I mean, I've got an idea. I mean, this is a burner channel. You think this thing would make a torch? Damn wind. Bottle's blown. Ran out of propane, but uh, I tell you what, that was uh, pretty freaking cool. We're gonna have to revisit this. This is definitely how I'll be cleaning this thing from now on. Okay, one thing that little test did show is that inside I have some 
undesirable eddy currents taking place it looked like so we're definitely going to want to redesign that i didn't put this thing together very well and i know why it's doing that there was some pinch points and i think those pinch points caused some little jets that are causing that dual swirl that we've seen however those did make for some extremely interesting combustion characteristics that i am definitely going to be revisiting definitely liked what i've seen as far as combustion very strange